ITD CNC have travelled to Milton Keynes today to the home of Idrafeed, and I'm joined by Martin. Now, Martin, you've recently took on a new product range, the long full-length bar feeder. Now, can you tell us about this new product range and why you've taken it on? Yes, of course. Thank you, G. Um, we've taken it on primarily to expand our portfolio of product. As, you, as you're all aware, Hydrofeed are known for short magazine bar feeds and more recently robot automation equipment. Um, and we are looking to do more and to expand our product range. We've always wanted to represent a full length magazine bar feed, but we've always wanted to represent the right one. And we believe that this is the one. It's Italian, European, completely manufactured. It sits very well with our product range, and this particular one, the X-Files, is aimed squarely at fixed head type machines where our focus of our product is, is fitted. Now, fixed head lathes, this, this, this particular product has a large range. Now, what is that range? This particular one, this, the X-Files model, has a range from 10 millimeters up to 100 millimeters. Um, clearly, there's um, certain considerations to be taken into account with 100 millimeters. We're going to require floor loading facility to get the bars into it. But the reason it can do that, the reason it has such a wide range, is because it, to a greater extent, breaks from tradition. There are no traditional guide channel systems involved in this, rather than one system that opens and closes upon command from the HMI screen here. So change over from one bar to another is a matter of a couple of minutes, rather than half an hour, 45 minutes on the more traditional equipment. And that was the main point which attracted us to us, apart from the build quality, of course. So there's major flexibility with this particular bar feeder, you know, being able to go from 10 millimetres all the way up to 100 millimetres without having to change any guide channels. I mean, that, that's, right. that's massive. The, the setup time alone is, is astronomical. I mean, that, that is a large part of the return of investment, I would imagine, Mark. Yes, it is, it is. It's exa exactly that, Gio, exactly that. And, and, and equally so, this bar feed on fixed head machines, we see the market for this on the higher end fixed head machines, where they're perhaps twin spindle, twin turret, where there's some very expensive tooling and such like within the confines of the machining envelope of the machine. And the bar remnant has to be retracted back through the bar feed. That's where the companies will really benefit from this kind of investment. Clearly, there's no bar remnant ejected into the machine to damage anything that's below it. These bar feeds are available in two, three, four, and six meter lengths. So if companies wanted to replace a short type magazine bar feed with a model such as this, what you're looking at here is a 3.2 meter. We could supply one that would allow you to do two meters and up to 100 millimeters. So it's it's a really quite exciting times for us. So really, you know, to, to summarise really, this new product range is really, it really complements your already existing range of automation products, not only the, the, the other bar feeders, the short bar feeders, but also your robo job, your roto rack. It's, it's another addition to your portfolio. That's exactly right. That's exactly why we were so keen when Top Automazione approached us. We went out to visit them to see their facility to see the wonderful facility that they have out there and the quality of the build, it, it sits perfectly within our product range. We can now offer short, long robot. We can convey, we can store parts, so we're not breaking away from tradition. We're just doing more of what we hope we're very good at. 